Next, we have carbohydrates. They are divided into two groups, starch and sugar. Their function is to provide energy to the body. And the starch comes from cereals, corn flour, potatoes, pasta, and flour. For the sugar, we can get it from fruit, vegetables, honey, milk, and malt products. Next, we have the fats, also divided into two groups. The first one is that of saturated fats and trans fats. The second group is that of polyunsaturated and monounsaturated fats. The first group is often called bad fats and the second group called good fats. Let's learn some facts that can explain why. Saturated fats raise the cholesterol level in the blood and may increase the risk of heart disease and stroke. They come generally from fatty beef, lamb, pork, poultry with the skin, lard and cream, butter, cheese and other dairy products made from whole milk or reduced fat milk. The trans fat generally come from fried foods like donuts, french fries, and baked goods like cakes, biscuits, frozen pizza, and cookies. As for polyunsaturated and monounsaturated fat, they both have beneficial effects on the heart when eaten in moderation and when used to replace saturated fat or trans fat. They come from plant-based oils like soybean oil, corn oil, or sunflower oil, nuts and seeds like walnuts, sunflower seeds, tofu, and soybeans, and also from oily fish like salmon, tuna, and mackerel. Now, let's summarize all this. There are four macronutrients, including proteins, carbohydrates, fats, and calories. Calories are provided in varying quantities by different types of food. The proteins assist with the growth and repair of the body and can come from animal products and other vegetable sources. Carbohydrates divided into two groups, starch and sugar, provide energy to the body and come from cereals, corn flour, potatoes, fruits, vegetables, etc. And the fats also divided into two groups, one called good fat, the other one called bad fat. What they do in the body is they help provide concentrated sources of energy and help insulate the body in cold weather. They come from animal sources for the saturated fats, fried food and baked food for the trans fat, and plant-based oil, nuts and seeds, and oily fish for the polyunsaturated and the monounsaturated fat.